Hey, another unboxing video. This is a big box. This is the Mortal Kombat Classic Sub-Zero one-third statue. You guys have been waiting a long time for these, so let's get to it. This is the art box. Turn around the art box. I believe Eamon O'Donoghue did the art box for us. Thank you, Eamon. So let's see. This is number 58 of 350. You open the box, protective. Here is our COA again, sorry, upside down. Oh, it's not 58, it's 56, my bad. 56 of 350. Here are the instructions for the batteries and, uh, not batteries, sorry, the power switch cord and the skull he's holding. Who is that? Is that Scorpion skull? I don't know. And of course the gloves, which I never use because I keep my hands clean. PCS collectibles, very important. This side up. Please do not open it with this side down. How do I look? Do I, oh, hi, we're back. All right, so we've opened them. We've cut open the, uh, the polyfoam and now we will, uh, now we will open him up. Here we go. What do you think? Um, we've got some supportive pieces of foam right here. We're actually going to use this one for our in-house display, so I don't have to uh, worry about this foam. This is the body. Before we get to that, let's get this base out. Here's the base. Here's the base. Um, you can see some nice wet blood applied on the snow. Okay, let's take the body out. This is a big, heavy statue. Be careful when inserting the foot. There is a connection to the power so that the ice globe glows. There we go. Okay, here's his head. The head and the neck uh, come with extra fabric. It's like a turtleneck. It's up to you to um, adjust it the way you like it. I've seen some pictures where his head and neck look too thin. Well, that's because they didn't take the time to adjust the fabric. You know, you gotta pull it out. You gotta make it have this turtleneck. Get it in there. And now you have that bunched up look. Please be careful when taking out the skull. You don't wanna break this. It's not fragile, but you could still break it with your big gorilla hands. The hand. So, there are two hands, two right hands. Let me show them to you. This right hand does not have pins. This one has pins. The reason is, if you want him to hold this, you will need those pins. They go like that. So, this inserts with a magnet right up into his wrist. There you go. Here's the hand with the ice ball. This is the power connector. Goes in here. Like that. The cord goes right here. And here's your on off switch. And ta-da. As I say many times, with collectibles that have mixed media fabric, you can't just pull them out of the box and expect them to look good. Your shirt doesn't come out of its package looking good. So you have to fluff it up, you know? I can't really see what I'm doing. I would be doing it from the front if I was doing it properly, but you've gotta, you know, 
Get those baggy ninja pants fluffed.